Advocates say Myanmar has more human rights cases over the last four years and criticized the government's weak response on the issue. They added that many of the people in rural areas are still being manipulated. Sumya Yerina reports. Equality Myanmar reviewed the findings of the Human Rights Review titled Supporting an Inclusive and Effective Participation of Local Voices. The findings will be presented in the UN-led Universal Periodic Review UPR, this year. Over 30 CSO from all parts of the Myanmar will submit information on 16 topics, especially on land issues, women rights, child rights, and LGBT rights. Advocate from Equality Myanmar pointed out that there are many weaknesses in 2011 UPR report, which receives 180 suggestions for Myanmar. The government, however, only accepted over 70 points. Even though the government signed laws or treaties, they don't mean anything at all without follow-up action. So here, I want to urge the government to submit the real situation about the country. Ativis also said that there is little to no improvement in the country's response to human rights violations, which they say continue to happen especially in conflict-hit regions. There is the emergence of National Human Rights Commission, but it still doesn't meet with some international human rights organization. So there's no difference in human rights conditions compared with the previous situation. We have to wait and see what the next government will do about this government's commitment in human rights. On Friday, the CSO will explain about this year's report to the ambassadors to Myanmar. CSO leader will attend the UBR Forum, which will be held in November this year at Geneva. Sumya Yedana for Amain TV, Myanmar International Television.